Do you have a moment? I, I think we need to talk. Oh, yes, I'm fine. I just... feel awful. Oh, it's nothing terrible. It's just... Well, maybe it is a little terrible. Look, I had a plan. A nice, simple plan. Seduce you, sleep with you, manipulate your feelings so you'd never turn on me. It was easy. Instinctive. Habits from 200 years of charming people kicked in. All you had to do was fall for it. And all I had to do was not fall for you. Which is where my nice, simple plan fell apart. You're... You're incredible. You deserve something real. I want us to be something real. I just don't know what real looks like. Not after 200 years playing the rake. <laughs> of course I was attracted to you. Look at you, for goodness sake. You're a vision. And you're so much more than that. I... <laughs> don't know. It's been so long since I've had to decide what I wanted. I don't know what to think. I, I don't know what I want. It's been so long since I've had to make these decisions for myself. I won't lie, it's a... taunting prospect. So this is the abode of our dear Absolute. It's about as cheerful as expected. Araj Oblodra, trader in blood and the sanguineous arts. It is a pleasure to stand before a true soul and your pale companion. I'd like to offer my services, if you're willing. <laughs> Please. You think someone in my line of work wouldn't recognize a vampire spawn when they see one? I trade in blood, and the potions that can be wrung from it. I'm more than happy to make you one, if you'd honor me with your blood. Just a little prick and it's all over. There we are. All of your very best traits, in a bottle. Use it well. Although perhaps there's one more thing we could discuss. Your vampiric friend. Oh, don't worry. We're all friends under the absolute. I won't bite. Oh, I'd prefer if you did. I assume he belongs to you? I'm sure he really believes that. How utterly adorable. Do you have a name, Spawn? <laughs> Astarian, but, but hold on. Good. Now, Astarian. I've dreamt of being bitten by a vampire since I was a young girl. Uh, I'm sorry, you want to be bitten? To feel your life's blood slipping away. To dance on the edge between life and death. Yes, I want it. I'll even compensate you. A potion of legendary power that forever increases the strength of the one who consumes it. It's not for sale. But it's yours, if you bite me. I will have to decline. <laughs> Excuse me? This is a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity, and you're squandering it. I gave you my answer. Uh, can't you talk some sense into your obstinate charge? I'm sorry, but could you excuse us a moment? Are you actually asking me to do this? Trading me for some, some, some potion. Because there's something wrong with her blood. I can smell it from here. It's rank. 
I can't say. It just smells... wrong. Unnatural. Drinking it wouldn't kill me, but it would not be pleasant. All right. Uh, thank you. Uh, it's still a no, I'm afraid. How very disappointing. Thank you. I appreciated that. I, uh, I want to thank you. For what you said. Whilst I was in front of that vile drow. I spent 200 years using my body to lure pretty things back for my master. What I wanted, how I felt about what I was doing, it never mattered. You could have asked me to do the same. To throw myself at her. What I wanted, be damned. But you didn't. And I'm grateful. It's a novel concept, I admit. And, uh... A little intimidating. It would have been so easy to bite her. To just go along with what I was being told to do. A moment of disgust to force myself through, and then I could have carried on just like before. Uh, I tried to pick beautiful people where I could, but there were so many over the years. After a while, you stopped caring. <laughs> the entire reason for my existence was to seduce anything with a pulse. And every instinct I have tells me that nothing's changed. I'm still just a means to an end. You made me see that I never stopped thinking like I was his slave. <sighs> Even in freedom. But I'm more than that. More than a thing to be used. Of course they did. That's the problem. Or part of it. Being... close to someone, any kind of intimacy, was something I... performed. To lure people back... for him. Even though I know things between us are different, being with someone still feels... tainted. Still brings up those feelings of disgust and loathing. I don't know how else to be with someone. No matter how much I'd like to. I don't think I want you to think of me in terms of sex. I don't know if I want anyone to. As a person? Would that be so much to ask? <sighs> it's a shame. But I don't want to risk treating you like you're one of his victims. <sighs> Perhaps it's better if we don't continue with whatever this was. Perhaps we'll both be better for it. Really? Why, that, uh, almost sounds like a challenge. <laughs> Honestly, I have no idea what we're doing. <laughs> or what comes next. But I know that this... This is nice. <laughs> 